My name is Jodie Bunting and this is Billy Craig and it's time for Meet the Judges. Okay, Billy, tell us a little bit about yourself. Um, I'm 32. I'm a Czech holistic lifestyle coach, um, which deals with a lot of nutrition, um, just people's general problems, really. Um, I'm about to be a Czech practitioner level one. I'm currently a Czech exercise coach. Um, I run my own clinic. Um, I've worked in a lot of gyms around Derby and kind of all over the globe really in different places meeting different clients um, so now I've just found that it suits me a lot better to just work on my own um, and get to uh, do the things I like to do with my clients. So. Within your health check business how have you helped people? Um, I see a varying array of clients really it keeps it quite interesting for me I think if I was just dealing with the same people day in day out the same problems which is what you tend to get in gyms and I get very bored so I can get people who've got cancer, um, all sorts of problems, MS, um, spinal problems, a lot of musculoskeletal injuries, um, so people come for sort of neuromuscular therapy, people come for dietary advice, people come just for exercise coaching, so they come and see me as a standard sort of personal trainer, so it gives me a varied kind of lifestyle and keeps me interested really and gives me lots of things to go and research and get my teeth into rather than just plodding along. I like it, a little bit of a challenge, really. And with regards to weight loss, what's been your biggest and best challenge yet? Um, I don't think it's been the people who've um, had the most weight to lose. Quite often it's the people who just want one or two stone. Um, and I think it's mainly because they don't want it enough. They might come and say they want it, but I don't think there's enough, enough reason for them there to do it. So it's, it's just something that kind of desire in the back of the brain. Um, generally it just has to be someone has to have a real reason to do it a real goal a lot of the time it's a health problem so that's the final kick that makes them do it sometimes it will be just the ego but not very often it's it's kind of like a pain pleasure thing so it's swapping between is the um, cake a better benefit in their eyes than the actual weight loss or the goal they've got so a lot of times until they hit, hit rock bottom um, then it's, it's too much of a problem really Okay, now Billy, you are a bit of a sport, Billy. Tell us about your BMXing. Um, I ride mountain bikes. I've raced for Great Britain, um, doing bike trials. Um, I've rode motorbikes since I was four, doing trials as well. I'm now 32, so I've been doing it quite a while. Um, hopefully, I'm getting a little bit better. Um, so I'm off to Scotland in May to go and do a competition for six days. Um, that's seven and a half hours a day, so that should be a pretty good challenge for my. Uh, dietary work to see if I actually do know what I'm on about um, in terms of sports form. It's alright, it's different doing um, somebody weight loss or weight normalisation to what it is doing sports performance, so it will be a good test for me. Your final question, we can see them poking out of your Fat Factor t-shirt. Tell us about your tattoos. Um, do you want to show us your arm? It's done by Ben in Derby. He's been a friend of mine for since I was about 15, I think I've known him. Um, it's just a, a collaboration of different pieces of art. I've always liked art, but I don't particularly like paintings on the wall. I'm kind of more interested in probably graffiti or something like that, so works by banks and things like that. So um, a bit of uh, art that I can actually carry around with is a little bit better for me, I think. Thank you very much, Billy. Thank you.